Hello, we're back. I'm back. I'm here with you. <laughs> I'm so dumb. <laughs> okay, so this is kind of funny. Not funny. Might be funny later. But I was already into like 15 minutes of recording and realized the camera shut off. For the battery because I didn't check the batteries yeah how smart so anyway let's start over hello how are you just kidding <laughs> oh my gosh no okay so what we're doing today is boxy charm here it is and I was actually supposed to get this two days ago and it wouldn't it just didn't come in i don't know why like it was uh, my tracking said i was supposed to get here february 12th and i usually get it like around that time and today's february 14th and i barely got here today so um uh, plus we got a date we got a date <laughs> so we're gonna take advantage of both to look good and to try out some stuff so things you miss because of my fault yes and I'm in a hurry still my husband about to be home any minute and I'm supposed to be ready to go get dinner so anyway uh, what did I do let's see the box let's look at the box so the theme is afterglow my variation is number three and first thing I saw when I opened the box was the Pharmacy Clean B um, Ultra Gentle Facial Cleanser. And as soon as I saw it, I had already exfoliated my face. And I went right back in there and just kind of tested this out. And it smells so good. Like so, so good. <gasps> He's home. Oh my gosh. Okay, I'm gonna be quiet now. He's still in the truck. So yes, I cleans my face with this and it smells so good and it's so like soft. Like it's not harsh on your skin, it doesn't burn, it doesn't anything. It just feels really really nice once you're rubbing on your skin feels really really good and it has an awesome smell like like your nature like you're really cleaning your face with nature yes so that was the one really good one and the retail for that one is $22 which that's pretty much the box already so that's good second item we have the touch and soul pore prime problem primers what is it no problem primer and I just tried it on and uh, you didn't see that but I'm wearing that already and I love it like I know my skin isn't perfect and I'm getting a bunch of acne and I used to not look like this like I used to have no acne back one year ago I used to have no acne and I don't know what's happening so you know so I was happy to get the cleanser just because I really need to figure out what to do with my skin because I used to not have any of this any like like one pimple was really odd and was really something that I would like freak out about not freak out like it's not something out of the other world but like it would bother me and now my whole face is full of it and I don't know so we tried this and what else we got in here? We got, ooh, okay, we got Too Faced, Better Than Sex with Scara, that we all knew we were gonna get because that was the very first sneak peek. And I didn't realize this thing was gonna be so heavy. Like, it's not like crazy heavy, but like it's like a metal feeling to it. And I have the trial one somewhere, and it's like half of the sides of it, but it's like plastic. 
So I thought it was going to be the same thing. The same material, but it's not. It's really fancy and nice. So we'll test that out. Even though I already have one. But we'll test it out too. And that retails for $24. Hmm. That's good. Next item. We got the Pretty Vulgar Shimmering Swan Highlighter. Well, let me open this. Now that I think about it. Oh, that's so pretty. That is so, so pretty. You can see that. Can you? Can you not? Um, no, I can't. My camera isn't the greatest. But yeah. That looks pretty. We'll try that out too. That one retails for $32. Oh my gosh. Okay, next thing that I see here is the Tristique Priming Glaze Lip Crying. It looks like this and kind of threw me off at first because I didn't, like I watched some videos but I didn't like watch them watching. Like I was more of listening them to them. So this was awesome. When they said the magnet, I was like, what are you talking about? This is so awesome. So awesome. And then I love the color. I just love that color right there. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, good tequila. And then it has the primer on the bottom. That's really fancy primer. What else? What else? What else? What am I missing? Well, I think that's it. Okay. So, let's start. I'll just put my foundation on now. Yeah, I'll put my foundation on now and then I'll come right back to try on the other stuff. Yeah. Alrighty, so we're back again and I'm gonna go ahead and try the Better Than Sex Mascara. And by this time, I had already done almost my full face, like my eyeshadow, eyeliner, brows, and foundation and contour. So just uh, left some spot to try the last items and yeah I actually did like that mascara a lot I really enjoyed it mainly because I don't like to use falsies but yeah Curl them both right, like the same way. I better stop there before they get all ugly for too many layers so there's that now let's try our new highlighter <laughs> kind of excited because I really haven't found one that ooh, that really no, I don't know if you can see that that really works good like Ooh, looks pretty like they a lot of them look really sandy on my face but 
I have to use like, I don't know, maybe it's my foundation or the way I'm doing it right now. I will fix it eventually, but we'll see. So I'm gonna go with this Luxie Tampered Highlight Brush. And just kidding. Let's not go too crazy. <gasps> my blush I forgot the blush no my blush my blush so I'm gonna go with this note blush that we got in the boxy charm too I don't remember when but we got it on one and this one I'm not a huge fan and this one's really really pigmented so what I'm gonna do is I dust it I'm gonna kind of rub it on my own first Just apply it there because I don't. to put it like on the apples on my cheeks because my cheeks are really noticeable so I don't like to make them more noticeable that's it mm -hmm. your girl what's up what's up just kidding That was good. Mm, that was really good. Okay.
so that's it mm. this lippy I mean it feels good but I think I don't know if it's the primer I don't know it looks okay it looks okay I'm just really into more matte colors. But it looks good. Looks good. Okay. So, I'm still looking at myself. Mm -hmm. I really like that highlight. Honest. Because I'm not that, like, I like the idea of highlight, but sometimes I feel like it does not look good on me. But this one looks really pretty. So let's go right there. Ooh, that changes everything. How did I forget that part? I think the lippy would look a lot good if I would have sticked to a brown eyeshadow. But everything just kind of got out of hand. I just like wine colors a lot. A lot. But it's good. It's all good. It's all good. Oh my gosh. I love this. Oh. My eyeliner isn't the greatest. I mean, I was kind of in a hurry. Let's do one more thing. Let's see how much our box was worth before I forget. Okay. Okay, it's a total of $121. Mm hmm And you only paid 21. You only paid 21. So that's a plus. My ponytail isn't the greatest. But that's what happens when you just come straight to this room. After work, trying to make yourself look decent. Maybe I should just... I need to start getting up early and getting ready in the morning. So, yeah. Hmm.